everyone! Welcome to Eat Me Recipes. Today I'll be showing you how to make the spiced roast leg of lamb. The ingredients for this recipe is in the description box below and there you will also find a link for the full written step-by-step -step recipe which is on eatmerecipes.co.za. First off, you want to preheat your oven to 180 degrees Celsius or 356 degrees Fahrenheit. We are going to begin by preparing the marinade, so bring out your favorite blender. To the blender, add in the garlic cloves. Add in lemon zest. Fresh thyme without the stems. Add in salt, cumin or jeera powder, cracked black pepper, olive oil, add in full fat plain yogurt. chili paste and white spirit vinegar. Close up your blender and blend until it forms a thick marinade. The marinade should be nice and creamy. Set this aside whilst we prep the meat. Bring out the leg of lamb. I've got mine from Hope Meats, which are based in Durban. Remove the leg of lamb from the packaging. Next, you want to trim off any excess fat and give it a rinse under running water. Using a sharp knife, we're going to score the meat on both sides. Once the meat is scored on both sides, we're going to bring out that delicious marinade. Add half the marinade onto one side of the lamb. Using clean hands, rub the marinade into the lamb, making sure to get into all those scores that were done earlier. Thereafter, we're going to flip it over. Add the remaining marinade onto the other side of the lamb. And once again, rubbing that marinade all over to the side of the lamb. Next, you want to place the marinated lamb into an oven bag and seal it. I'm using the Glad oven bags and they also come with this blue seal which makes it easier to tie it. 
Next you want to use a knife and pierce the oven bag here and there at the top only. This will allow for the steam to escape. Next, place it into the preheated oven for one hour. After one hour, carefully remove the lamb out of the oven bag and place it directly onto a casserole. Sprinkle over some flaky salt, this is optional. Add some fresh rosemary. Place the leg of lamb back into the oven for an extra 10 minutes. At this point, it should have a lovely color on it. Set the lamb aside for at least 20 minutes before cutting it through. This will ensure that the juices remain in the lamb. After 20 minutes, you can start plating. Garnish with some freshly chopped parsley or coriander. You can serve the spiced leg of lamb with Yorkshire pudding or some fresh salads and even some delicious gravy. Slice through and enjoy! The meat is absolutely succulent on the inside and the flavours are incredible. Just a quick reminder, the quantities are in the description box below and there you will also find the direct link for the full written recipe which is on eatmerecipes.co.za. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And also drop some recipe requests in the comment section and I will try to do those recipes as soon as I can. Enjoy!